y'all so to start off with this review i'm gonna first prep my face i'm gonna go back to an oldie but a goodie this is the Too faced protective <laughs> if y'all hear something and look stand up what? say hey hey okay sit down <laughs> um this is Too faced protective and nourishing hangover primer so i'm going to put that all over my skin foundation that we're reviewing y'all I really know is the LA Girl Pro Matte HD High Definition Long Wear Matte Foundation so we're gonna test this out and see what's up see what's up the shade that I got is gold and bronze and it claims to be a matte liquid foundation it says medium to full coverage smooth long wear suede finish so we're gonna shake this bad boy up and I haven't opened it. As you guys can see, the wrapper is still on it. But we better open it up now. Foundation, it has a sleek bottle to it. This is just from me moisturizing my skin. And this is just how it looks. So it's really cute, really convenient to travel with. And it comes with a pump, which everyone loves. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So to apply it on my face, I will be taking my Real Technique Body Complexion Sponge. And we're just going to go ahead. I'm going to put it on here. We're going to do... That was... Okay. One, two. Let's start off with two first on this side. And let's see what kind of coverage it gives us. It said medium to full coverage. So let's see. Um, the color is definitely a little, little light, but also I have a tan because it's the summertime. But let's just see. Okay, so if I, um, come up a bit, you can definitely tell that it's not full coverage. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I can definitely still see some of my marks, but it is not a light coverage. This is a more medium coverage as of, like... If you want to just have natural and you want it to look natural, this will be a good foundation for that. The color, I mean, the color kind of matches. I don't know how well it's picking up on camera, but over here it doesn't look too bad. I'm going to build this up some more, so I'm going to do two more um, pumps. And I just want to see what that does because I love full coverage. But I don't want it to be like too cakey. So let's see what this do. Alright y'all. So definitely. It looks like it has a kind of uh, dewy finish to it. I don't know if you guys can see that glow. But it's a little bit glowy. But. The coverage is okay. It's, it says it's a medium to full coverage. So. I think that this is acceptable and it says what it is. It's not claiming that it's full, full coverage, but it is saying it's a medium to fuller coverage if you build it up. But like I said, it's not the best coverage. I mean, it's good coverage, but I can still see like some of my marks with other foundations. It looks like my skin is flawless. Um, The color is definitely off, as you guys can see from this side. To this side it kind of got like an orangey olive tone into it I don't know if that's the correct words I'm looking for but <laughs> this is how this side looks and this is how this side looks okay y'all so um it definitely has dried all the way down to a matte finish so that is a true claim um this color is not too bad um once i conceal my face and put all of my powders and stuff it should definitely definitely look good um this coverage is not bad at all actually now that i'm looking at it it is not bad and i can actually do this coverage like it's awesome so um, i'm gonna see how it reacts with all the powders and stuff like all i right, said so as you guys can see i am done with my entire face and this is just how my face looks and actually 
that looks pretty good. So, I would give this foundation an 8 out of 10. I mean, a 1 out of 10. Hmm. Honestly, so far, I would give this foundation a 9. And the reason why it's not a 10 is because it says, it says medium to full coverage. I love when my foundation is just full coverage and I don't have to keep building it up. Um, but I can't really. I guess I can't really judge it by that because when I picked it up, it said me it was a full coverage and it did what it did. So for that, I would give it a 10 out of 10, but I'm giving it a 9 out of 10 because I love full cover foundation. But I guess being fair, I would give this a 10 because it did what it said. It's mad. I don't know how long this is going to last, but I will update you guys like that in another video or something about this foundation but all in all i love this foundation actually and i will be wearing this a lot it's really cool i'm trying to hurry up because i got somewhere to go so if you guys like this video make sure that you give me a big thumbs up thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel and i will see you guys in the next one bye Mwah.